God bless you on this faithful Friday. I'm praying for you that you have a wonderful weekend. And as we go into the weekend, just want to put this word in your spirit, you know, to take advantage of the time that you have with your loved ones, to cherish that time because we don't know what a day is going to be hold. And sometimes we get bogged down in things that are, are haven't even happened yet. And I don't want that to be something that holds you from enjoying what God has blessed us with today or or um, keep you from really enjoying yourself in the present time, amen? Because we're living in an evil day. You know, we know there's, a, there's all manner of evil that's happening around us and maybe a lot of attacks that are happening in your life, but I want you to take heart, you know? Let not your be hope, but let not your heart be troubled. You know, the Bible talks about neither let it be afraid. If you believe in God, also believe in Jesus, his son. Amen. You know, uh, the Bible talks about, uh, you know, considering all the things that we uh, take for granted. He's, he, he talks about in Matthew uh, 26 through 34, he says, behold, the, the birds of the air, they don't sow. Or they reap, they don't gather in barns, yet our Heavenly Father feeds them every day. Aren't you more better than them? <laughs> Which of you, by taking thought, can add one inch to your height or your stature? And why are you taking thought or thinking about your clothes? Consider the lilies of the field, how they grow, how, how they, they, they don't work, and neither do they spin. Yet I say unto you that even Solomon in all of his glory was not clothed like one of them. Wherefore, if God so clothes the lilies of the valley, which is today here and tomorrow cast into the oven, shall he not much more clothe you? And then he says, O ye of little faith, therefore take no thought, saying, What will you eat, or what will you drink, or where will you get your uh, clothes from? He says, For all these things do the gentles. This, this is what the, the people of the world do. He said, For your heavenly Father knows that you have need of all these things. But he says, seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these other things will be added unto you. Therefore, take no thought of those things that are, are that you're thinking about in the, in, the, in the future. He said, for tomorrow will take thought of itself. Sufficient as the day is the evil thereof. In other words, enjoy today. Amen. Let it be your day. To give God praise and give God glory and watch him show you how he's provided for you. And if you if he's provided for you yesterday and the day before and today, he'll provide for you tomorrow. Amen. Hope it blesses you. God bless you. Thankful Thursday is now Faithful Friday. Happy birthday, Deja. We love you. Bye-bye.